Good morning, Bulldogs. Welcome to BHS TV. I'm Julia Bolanikian. And I'm Marietta Mukherjian. And here are your announcements for today, Friday, October 27th, 2023. What a great spirit week it has been. Hopefully, everyone enjoyed the homecoming rally today and the football game tonight. Dress Up Days continued this week with today's class colors, movie characters for the rally. Freshmen are the Halloween movie, sophomores are the Scream movie, juniors are the Beetlejuice movie, and seniors are the It movie. This is all in preparation for the annual rival game between Burbank High and Burroughs tonight at 7 p.m. So wear blue. There are also some things to remember for tonight's game. Gates open at 5 p.m. and kickoff is at 7 p.m. You must purchase tickets ahead of time, so scan the QR code on the screen to get your tickets. You must get a ticket even if you have an ASB card. BHS is on the home side this year. Please, no backpacks unless it is clear. The student store is now selling clear backpacks, so get yours before the game. There will be no ins and outs. Once you leave, you will not be allowed back in the gate. There is no entry after the third quarter starts and no crossing the field. We also stress having good sportsmanship. Here's a look at what good sportsmanship looks like between our two schools. Playing sports in high school is one of the greatest experiences a student can have. It's not just about winning, it's about pushing yourself to be the best on and off the track. Being a student athlete is a path to greatness. It's where you'll build physical fitness, character, teamwork, and the skills to excel in life. For some of us, high school sports are just the beginning. We'll go on to represent our colleges and universities, competing at the highest level. But sometimes, what happens in the stands can take away from the action on the field. We all love the rivalry between our schools, but let's remember that sportsmanship should always come first. Let's come together and make a change. Let the players play. It's never fun to be booed or yelled at during a game. Cheer on your team instead of rooting against the other team. Let the coaches coach. It's easier for them to focus on the game when the spectators stick to cheering positively. Remember, officials are people too. Let referees do their job. You may not agree with every call, but being negative will affect your team in the long run. And as always, keep the cheering positive and free of profanities. Many of our community want to bring their family and enjoy the game without negative or inappropriate comments. We may be rivals on the field, but sportsmanship is bigger than any one game or match. Keep it on the field. Keep it on the track. Keep it on the courts. Let's, Let's keep, keep it, it in, in the water. water. Please keep these in mind as we cheer on our Bulldogs. Attention Bulldogs! This Saturday night, our own Vocal Music Association is presenting Night of Magic Halloween Edition 3 here in our BHS quad. This Halloween-themed show features our awesome vocal groups and many special acts. Our special guest will be BHS alum and star of TV's famous 70s sitcom, Happy Days, Anson Williams. Student tickets will be available at the door for $25 with your school ID. You must have a student ID to enter the show on a student ticket. Student tickets will include show slash dessert and special student seating. Costumes are encouraged. They can't wait to see you there. The Crafting Club is back with their Halloween sale. Come to the Mini Quad on Monday, October 30th and check out their Halloween-inspired display. 30% of the proceeds will go to the International Institute of Los Angeles, which is focused on helping refugees and displaced families. They hope to see you there. Please help support the Auxiliary Club slash Color Guard with their Halloween Lollipop Ghosts fundraiser. On Halloween Day, Tuesday, October 31st at the front gates, swing by and support your Auxiliary Club and Color Guard with their Lollipop sales, starting from period 6 through 4.30 p.m. Lollipops will be on sale for $1. They thank you for your support. Hey Bulldogs, BHS Helping Hands is partnering with One Tree Planted. For every dollar we raise, one tree will be planted in California. We're raising money through recycling. In each classroom, you will find a bag along with a flyer. Please dispose of your plastic bottles and cans in these bags and help us reach our goal of a thousand collected bottles. We got this, Bulldogs. Reminder, AP tests are now on sale at the student store. You can purchase them on the web store or at the window during nutrition and lunch. 
You must be in the AP Classroom on the College Board site for the test you are purchasing. A test cannot be ordered if a student is not in the AP Classroom. For exam-only codes, reach out to Ms. Barzagar. Students who qualify for free or reduced lunch may also qualify for the reduced fee. Make sure you have your application done in time to qualify. The deadline to purchase AP exams will be 3.30 p.m. on Wednesday, November 8. A $40 late fee will be charged to each test purchased after this date. There are no exceptions for technical difficulties or any other issues. Please do not wait until the last minute to make your selection and allow time to reach out to troubleshoot. The BHS Armenian Club is hosting a movie night next Friday, November 3rd from 6.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. Tickets will be available for pre-sale at the student store for $10 and at the door as well for $15. If you have not already bought tickets, we will be having week-long sales next week in the main quad. The featured movie is Lost and Found in Armenia. And you are not required to be an Armenian club member to come and watch. All proceeds will be donated to the displaced people of Artsakh, so please come out and support this great cause. Seniors, the deadline to get your senior portrait taken so that it will appear in this year's yearbook will be Friday, November 3rd. Please make your appointment with White Studios Online to reserve your spot. No appointments will be accepted after this date for inclusion in the yearbook. So don't delay, book those portrait sittings now. Also, seniors, please submit your senior quotes and baby pictures to the Google Forms on the Class of 2024 Google Classroom. All rules are posted and the deadline to get your quote and baby pic submitted is also Friday, November 3rd. If you have any questions, contact Amy Wynn at amywynn at burbankusd.org. For further information and updates about this year's yearbook, follow Burbank HS Yearbook on Instagram. Attention, BHS students. Do you need help with your homework or to study for a test? After school tutoring is available in the library on Mondays and Wednesdays from 3.30 p.m. to 4.30 p.m. by CSF members. Hope to see you there. BHS Operation Smile is a club representing the international nonprofit organization Operation Smile, which provides free surgery for children with a cleft lip or palate. A cleft lip is an opening or split in, in the lip or palate that occurs when facial features that are not entirely developed during pregnancy. Without surgery, kids with a cleft lip or cleft palate may have life-threatening feeding difficulties, a speech impediment, and can face bullying. The club is doing a fundraiser where donation boxes will be placed in classrooms so students can donate to help children receive free surgeries. Only a few classrooms have the donation box, so if you would like to donate and your class doesn't have one, go to Ms. Beal's room, room 1213, to give your donation. 100% of the donations will go to the nonprofit organization Operation Smile. Make sure to donate before Monday, November 20th, since donation boxes will be collected on this day. In College and Career Center news, CSUN Open House will be held on Saturday, October 28th, 8.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. Calling all high school juniors, seniors, and upper division transfer students. Join in for a free, fun, and informative day on campus. Drop by the computer lab for hands-on support with your Fall 2024 CSUN application. See the flyer in the Career Center Google Classroom for QR code to register. There are also some really great upcoming college visits that include Monday, October 30th, USC, 10.30 in the computer lab. Students must sign up by Friday, October 27th at 4 p.m. in order to receive a pass to learn more about USC. Wednesday, November 1st, CSUN, 10.30 in the computer lab. Thursday, November 2nd, University of Oregon at 12.30 in the Career Center. Monday, November 6th, Rutgers at 9 a.m. in the Career Center. Wednesday, November 8th, University of Redlands at 9.30 in the Career Center. On Tuesdays, there continues to be representatives from LAVC on campus during lunch and on Wednesdays, a representative from GCC on campus during lunch. So please take advantage of these great opportunities and find out what these great schools have to offer. There are lots of volunteer opportunities coming up in the next couple weeks. Check out the Career Center Google Classroom for details and links to sign up. Jefferson Elementary Halloween event, Saturday, October 28th. Volunteers are needed from 1 p.m. to 7 p.m. The event goes from 3 to 5 p.m. They are seeking volunteers to help with arts, crafts, games, and trick-or-treating at the fall celebrations tables, including, but not limited to, Halloween, Armenian Harvest Festival, Dia de los Muertos, Mid-Autumn Festival, Diwali, Merigan, All Hallows, Eve, Sukkot, and more. Email Jessica O'Keefe at jessicaoemail at gmail.com. Sign up using the link QR code or through the link found in the Career Center Google Classroom. Code ELE5ND. Other volunteer opportunities include Saturday, October 28, Disney Elementary, 
Dia de los Muertos, 4.30 to 7.30. Saturday, October 28, Magnolia Park Methodist Church, tr Trunk or Treat, from 5 to 9. In sports news, today our varsity football team takes on Burroughs at 7 p.m. at Memorial Field for our rival homecoming game. Please come out and show your support for our BHS sports teams and show your Bulldog Blue school spirit. In tennis, we would like to wish a special congratulations to Sina Hamill for taking second place in the Pacific League singles competition and qualifying for CIF individuals. And congratulations to Mira Hamill and Daphne Harbaugh for taking third place in the doubles competition. We are so proud of you. BHS Boys Volleyball tryouts for grade 9 through 12 will be held on Friday, November 3rd in the BHS gym. You must be physically cleared prior to trying out. All skill levels are welcome. If you have any questions, email coach Brandon Villaflor, brandonvillaflor at gmail.com. In honor of Veterans Day, BHS Baseball, in collaboration with the VFW, will be hosting a Veterans Appreciation at our game on Thursday, November 9th. There will be a live performance of the National Anthem, a stand-up for veteran honors, hot dogs, nachos, and some incredible baseball. Ceremonies begin at 5.45 p.m. with the honorary first pitch at 6 p.m. Spread the word and let's do what we can do to pack the stands in honor of those who have served our country. We encourage all veterans to attend. Have a family member who served? Bring them. Have a neighbor who served? Bring them. No better way to honor our veterans than have a good old Bulldog baseball game. And that's it for today's sports news. Okay, Bulldogs, that's it for today's BHS TV video announcements. On behalf of the cast and crew of BHS TV, thank you for watching. And always remember, it's, it's great, great to be a Bulldog. Bulldog.